It was one of the deadliest attacks against Americans in Afghanistan this year. And tonight we have learned the NYB detective, detective here is one of the six service members ambushed and killed by suicide bombers today. Good evening, everyone. I'm Maurice Dubois. And I'm Christine Johnson. CBS 2's Jessica Schneider is following this breaking story from our newsroom tonight. Jessica? Yeah, Christina Maurice, Detective Joseph Lem was a 15-year veteran of the NYPD. He was serving with the Air National Guard in Afghanistan when he was killed by a suicide bomber earlier today. Detective Lem was a dedicated family man and loyal member of the NYPD. Commissioner Bratton praised his service to the city and the country. Detective Lem was one of several American service members stopped at a local meeting point while on patrol with Afghan forces near Bagram Airfield. A suicide bomber on a motorcycle packed with explosives drove into the group. The blast killed six members of the military, and the Taliban is now claiming credit for the attack. Black bunting hangs tonight outside the 50th precinct where the Bronx Warrant Squad is based. Detective Lem was a member of that squad. Detective Lem was deployed three times, twice in Afghanistan and once in Iraq. And Detective Lem leaves behind a wife and two children. So far this year, 20 American service members have been killed in Afghanistan. This attack that killed Detective Lem was the deadliest against U.S. forces since August. Live in the newsroom, Jessica Schneider, CBS 2 News. Jessica, thank you. And